spicy, crunchy curry stir fry. Hi guys, welcome back to Thai Caliente. Today we're making a Thai recipe called Pat Pri King Gai. So essentially it is a stir fry with curry paste. We're gonna be using chicken and some green beans. So traditionally curry is made with coconut milk and you get that kind of soup like texture. This one's a very dry curry. So we're just gonna be doing the curry paste and then stir frying it with our protein and green beans. It comes out super fast, it's spicy, crunchy, and just like a quick and easy meal. Let's get started. So I have some chicken breast here that I've just sliced into about one inch pieces and I'm adding some oil. You don't wanna slice the chicken too thin because you kinda of want it to be a meaty dish since it's only chicken and green beans in this dish. So over a pan, over medium low heat, add a little bit of oil. This is the Messy Priking curry paste. The instructions say to use the entire can, but it is spicy. So if you want more of a medium spice, um, just use about half the can and it still had a pretty good kick to it. So if you are sensitive to spice, then add less. I added about a quarter cup of water just to dissolve the curry paste. So just kind of gauge it to see how much you need. Remember, we don't want this to be um, very saucy, but we do want enough curry paste to coat all of the chicken. So I increased the heat to medium and added the sliced chicken breast. And you wanna cook this till about it's almost done. Once the chicken is almost fully cooked, go ahead and add some sliced green beans. These are about one inch pieces. To make this dish authentic, you would do Chinese long bean, which you can find at an Asian grocery store. Otherwise, green beans work as well. And then to top it off, I'm adding some fresh magut lime leaves. Again, these are hard to find, but I have a tree in my backyard and it just kind of adds a pop of brightness and freshness to the dish. And it's done. How easy was that? So Gai Pat Peking is best served with some steamed hot jasmine rice. If you want it a little bit saltier, you can add more fish sauce, but I thought the messy curry paste had the perfect amount of seasoning. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.